my name is Lance Davids and I graduated in 1995. I had a lot of fond memories of Ileana. Uh, one of the reasons I am still there as a teacher over 22 years now is because of the experiences I had at Ileana. And that's why I'm still there today because I saw what my life was like and how people impacted me and how that just drives you for the rest of your life. But over the years, my roles have changed. Now I deal more with in an administrative role as a director of spiritual development and vision and advancement of how we continue to push the school forward. When I look at the future at Ileana, that I think there's a lot of people right now who realize the importance of Christian education. I think 75 years ago, I can't imagine those, those conversations where we're gonna start a high school and how daunting that was gonna be and is this gonna work and is there gonna be funding for it? Do we have the support? It's now more important than ever in this world and in our culture to make sure that we are daily providing education that not only teaches them about life, but teaches them about God and gives them the tools to be able to deal and thrive in this world and be a difference maker. I'm excited about the future of Ileana because I think when people understand the stakes that are involved now when it comes to our children, and then not just go through life being average, we want them to be ferocious followers of Jesus Christ. We want to be the great husbands and fathers and wives and um, all of those things. We want them growing and passionate. And that's a goal of ours. And I think everyone's kind of on that same page. And our new vision statement is developing a passion for God, people, and the world. And we're really embracing how it all starts with Jesus and our love for him. And it, it needs to be a passionate thing. It's not just something we do. He, it is a relationship we have with the God of the universe. And we want that to be first and foremost. The second thing is we need to care about the people that God puts in our life. The greatest commandment is love God and then love your neighbor as yourself. And that's what we need to do a better job in them, realizing we're a team. And then the third part is the world is going out and making a difference. And that can be in your home, that can be in your church, that can be in your place of business. It doesn't have to be across the world, but it can be. But we want you actively engaged in this culture to transform it for Jesus. And that's our goal and our new vision for the next five years, and we're actively working to make that happen. When I think of 75 years, you don't get to 75 without tremendous prayer, support, encouragement, and people serving. And for the last 75 years, this community has rallied around this school. And for any role that you've played, no matter how big and small, from the bottom of our hearts, we want to say thank you. And we also, as we look forward to another 75 years, we're going to need the same prayer, support, service, and just passion that we have seen to continue to grow as a school, but also on a small level, realize that every kid that walks through these halls matters. And we need to give our best effort in how we train them up to live for Jesus.